Welcome back, everyone. This is Super Stud Brother playing Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. We are now in the Goron Mines. About to make our way towards where Darvis is being held hostage by his own tribe. They did it for his own good. Woo! That was a close one. That was way too close. Ah! Okay. Apparently, I didn't learn from the last time. Now I did. Just get that out of the way. Smack this, I guess. Step on this switch. You put your boots on. That presses that switch down. You take your boots off. Run across this before it lights back up. Eh. Okay. Press this switch down. That turns that off, which is clear over there, but that's not a problem because we can get there faster than we can restart itself. Oh, but wait, we have to go across here first. Alright. No big whoopee. And that was some sort of uh, fire breathing Zora, I guess. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, Link. Bad boy. Um, I don't think there's anything over there worth getting. Not a word. Whoa. Slow down, Junior. Turn around, turn around. Mm, lovely. You do want this. And you want to watch out for that slug. Oh, fine. This button. There. That thing over there. Clear over there. Run for it! Run, 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 run! Ah! No, 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 no! Woo! We made it! With seconds to spare, that stupid slug got in our way. Okay, this is what we do. We jump onto this thing, and we put on our boots. Simple as that. Three of them at the same time. Oh yeah. Let me just continue. Bark. Those moblin whatever thingies like to bark. Those things are magnets. Yes, they have developed technology to the point where they have created magnets. Imagine that. Goron, no less. Boom. Oh, there we go. On occasion, Link will flip his sword before he puts it back on his back. I'm not sure when. Usually after defeating all the enemies, we got a key, and let's go use it. We come over this direction. All right. Cross that. Wait for that turn. Then cross it. Cross it. Be careful not to jump too far. And that's what we use that key for. Now we just make our merry way down this ramp. Jump down here and we will be confronted with this Dodongo. Whose, weakness, whose only weakness is his tail. As usual. Darn. Bang. Gives us plenty of hearts, though, in case we ever needed them. These usually have things in them. Rupees, mostly. Or nothing. Nothing works. Okay, watch out. These... These things will pop up in the uh, most annoying of places. Inconvenient. 
like there, because we will need to move fast, and those things are going to be in our way. Darn you! Die, bugger! Whoa! Wow! That was weird. Smacked right through his head. Yeah, we just pick this up, we put it back, and you'll want to keep a hold of it. And you want to keep pulling back until those flame pillars go down. Then you'll run! So you jump across here, and then we jump across here, and then we hurry, 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 because it's closing in on... Okay. Just like that. Well, this looks like a cool room. Literally. We have to somehow get up there. We have this water, put on our boots. If you've played Ocarina of Time, or if you've used your brains, you just step on the switch. Activates that magnet, and then we can just walk on this bluish, greenish stuff. This bit like these uh, pixelated, whatever it is, platform. Blue, green, pixelated platform. Ooh, I hear something. Hey, Shorty. Ah, I thought I found a presence. What a surprise to find a young human. Or it has come to me of you. And if Gorkoron has faith in you, then your heart must be true. I am one of the Vorgaron elders. Goromalto is my name. You are a heroic young human. Please, you must lend this tribe your power. We got a key shard! We need all three shards to return the big T to its original shape so we can get to Darbus, who is in the boss chamber. Yada yada yada. That is one of the key shards that when merged together form the key to the room where Darbus is being held. He is our patriarch. The key is split into three pieces. Each of us elders keeps a piece. That's just what I said. You must hurry to the other elders. All right. There's this treasure box which has a map, I believe. And I was right. This one just has 50 rupees, I think. Nope, 20. Oh well. I was close. Just climb this ladder. Make a merry way up this up here. Uh, it's over here. Ah, but we need somebody familiar if we pick up this pot or break it. Either one works. Phew! Free at last! Gracious! You're that nice fellow who helped me out the other day! How nice to meet you again! Well, now that we've found each other again, let's stick together for a bit, mm hmm? I'll be right with you, so if you so if you want to warp out, just let me know. Alright, Uku. Be reunited with Uku. She will let us out of this dungeon if we equip her, if we ever need to leave this dungeon. And you can't pull out your sword for this. Which is why I picked up the pot. Okay, don't jump down. Do not jump down. These things are here for a reason. This is what you put your iron boots for. Just kill those guys. They like to be annoying. Okay, slowly, slowly make our way down, and then we made it. Bye back. direction you want to go is this way. Yes, there is a specific direction you need to go. Just follow the map.
I wonder, isn't Link's hat supposed to be like dangling down? What the? No! 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 Excuse me for a moment. Sorry about that. I had to get a new remote. My batteries died. Anyways, making our merry way. Now we come over in this direction. As you can see on the map, if we can move faster! Move faster! Faster if you just walk rather than target. Okay, we're almost there. We just need to move a little faster. Get those guys out of the way because they can be real jerks. And probably want to be as far in here as possible. Just in case. You don't want to fall to your and I have to start all over and get back up. Bark, 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 bark. All right. Let's round up them little doggies. Oh. Target this guy in his life before he gets back up. That's why we learned that trick, folks. You're the man, Link. You're the man. Alright, step on this switch. Activates that magnet. And I think all we have to do is wait. Maybe. Nope, we have to go over there. Oh, we need to hurry. We need to hurry! Oh, fudge. Oh, well. We'll just wait here for it to come back. Alright, waiting, waiting. And drop! Yeah, I didn't think so, but... Hey! That wasn't fair! I was busy! Alright, now step on this switch! Let's like step on it. Wait for it, wait for it. Oh, there we go. Swing, buddy, buddy! Oh, yeah! That's how Link does it. Alright, wait, wait. Where are we? Okay. I got temporarily lost. As I tend to. Red tectites. Hi. Hi, bugger. All right, there. All right, now we just jump into the water. Put on our boots. Push this block. We can get in here now. We come back up. We can swim up faster if we wanted to, which we do. Maybe. Jump this button. These things are full of them. Jump and equip the boots. And voila. We can walk on the ceiling! We are Spider-Man! Whoa, 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 slow down, Junior. Wow. Alright, here's the, here's the deal. Just run off of here. Drop! Put on your boots! And do some more walking. There's not going to be any other temples after this that'll require you to use your iron boots too much. 
Which is a shame. I just cry in shame. But hey. Okay, we dodge in here. Kill those guys. Kill that guy. Right in the sensitive area. Alright. We are over time, so this is Super Stunt Brother, to be continued!